Yeah, you are a little low on time. Yeah. That's so why, like, we counted over that a few times. I just felt like it was reasonable to not. Sure. Ha, ah, he milled away his guy. Good. Rune catcher pike. Pretty cool. Oh, I just main phased that. Whatever. Like, I don't even care. You don't even care. Look at you. Stone cold apathy. <clears throat> the rune catcher pike is gonna be so good. On your moon heron. Wait, what did you... Huh? What are you doing? Play land. It's your turn. Yeah, I know. Oh, you just, like, skip past your first main phase. I was confused. Oh, I see. <clears throat> do you want to play Watchkeep, Watch or do you want to play... No, you don't want to play Deranged Assistant. No. Your Moon Heron is... <clears throat> sure. Moon Heron's gonna be pretty pretty nice with the pike, because like even if he gets like tons of spiders, the first strike like eliminates them. Maybe not even all of them, but a yeah. good number. No, like this is really mm. good. Yeah. It's already getting plus two plus oh. Mm -hmm. Hmm. Do I want to just kill his guy and play my own guy? Or do I just want to play the Heron? I think... Because uh, if he draws a land, then he could <clears throat> do it next turn, but then it wouldn't even matter because there would only be three spiders. Yeah. I guess I just want a Heron first. Yeah, I think so. And maybe you'll draw a land next turn and you can Geist Flame and play the Pike. That would be good, yeah. Well, there's a Splinter Fright. Oh, that's the foil one. Last game, yeah. I don't think he had the foil one, did he? I'm not sure. I don't remember. Oh, and he milled his... Spider spawning. Yeah. <clears throat> Boy, that rune catcher pike is looking pretty nice right now. Yeah. Yup. Great. Looking pretty nice. <laughs> Got a little overzealous. Yeah, don't forget the guy slay this dude. Because that's an additional point of damage. I will. Hooray. Yeah, getting there. Yep. Next turn you can Desperate Ravings for like a bunch of cards. Oof. Yeah, he did get both Splinter Frights. Yeah. <laughs> I wouldn't have been surprised if he just scooped there. He needs a Swamp. Yep. Didn't he Traveler's Amulet? Sure. Oh, he, he was about to Spider Spawning and then he was like, no, I should do this first. Six. Is that? Six. <clears throat> Alright, so you need to kill a bunch of them. Sure. So, you could Desperate Ravings, which... kills... Oh, that's good, because now you can flash back a Geist Flame. Oh, if you want to, but you probably don't want to. I could flashback Silent Departure, just kill one. Yeah, but like, okay, so it's 7 2. You cast Ancient Ravings. Oh, I play Desperate Ravings. Def Desperate Ravings. And then at least one card goes to my graveyard. Yeah, so that's 8. And then he still has lethal damage on your. 2, 4, 6, 8. Yeah. If I discard a. another um, spell. That's kind of risky, though. It is risky. <clears throat> you think I should just play this? Yeah, I think you should play that now. And then a swing knowing what you have in your hand. Okay. Because you might get, like, a think twice, you know? Yeah. That seems good.
What did you discard? Just my assistant. Okay. Eight. I got a forbidden alchemy, but... Oh, this is actually great, because I yep. can put another one in there. And, and then yeah. this is another one. Yep. So as long as there's one spell in the top two. Yep, I think that's worth swinging. I agree. Like, what are the odds? The odds are pretty low. Everybody, line up. I'm surprised he's not just blocking with one. Yeah, me too. Well, like, this is the gamble. But he doesn't know what I have in my hand. Yep. Leave... Leave blue open. Or leave red open. No, I have two guys flames in the graveyard. Oh, you already have both? Okay. Yeah. So dream twist is what you would yeah. do. Um, well, the runic repetition can go to your graveyard, and then you have another rune catcher. The pike goes to my you. hand. Yeah, yeah, it goes to your hand. Yep. Seems great. That's so awesome. <laughs> oh, rune catcher's pike. Rune, rune chanter. Whatever. <laughs> That's so silly. Whatever, indeed. Yeah, that was really funny. Uh, he's got flashback. Nope, not yet. One more land. Yeah. But by that time, you're gonna have a second pike. That's hilarious. Yeah. That's just crazy. But at that point, he can just chump block forever. That's actually a problem. <clears throat> I mean, but yeah, that's... I mean, you're just gonna have to F6 a bunch of your turns. Oh, Good. also this is happening. Also that's happening. Mm. Oh, I just pike up both of them, and it's fantastic. Um, should you... Burning Vengeance? And then, no. That no. no. Do that oh. next turn. You don't have... I thought you had enough to, like, Silent Departure, but you don't. You just pike up both of them and then play Burning Vengeance after combat. Er. Yes. That'll flip your guy, though. And I don't think you want to flip your guy. Well, I might. Like, it depends on what he does now. If he goes to, like, four. No, uh -huh. he's just blocking everyone. Alright, maybe I just. Let him flash back his thing on his turn. Yeah. So funny. He's dream twisting himself? Mm hmm. Now he's flashing back his spider spawning. Yep. God, this interface is the worst. Yeah. His ghoul catcher's built on the stack. Yeah. There Seriously. You go. <clears throat> How many guys is he gonna get? He should hit okay or something. Eight. Sell off a cultist. Yeah? Yeah, and then you can just start milling him. Like, that's the way that you put... He's got another spider spawning. Oh. Well, yeah, then you need the self off a cultist. To like, start Like, that's how you're winning him? this game. Yeah. Because you're just not going to get through. How many guys do I attack with? Both. And then I just have six. Um, I think you 
Play Burning Vengeance. Mill him, right? Yeah. Oh, you already have six. Never mind. Well, I didn't want my guy to flip back. Well, I was thinking because you have the occultist now to attack. Oh, I see. Do you still have a dream twist? No? Yes. You do. Yeah, like, you can dream twist him, flash, like, burning vengeance, dream twist him, kill one of his guys. Sure. He has infinite spiders. Mm -hmm. We knew that this would happen. <clears throat> I just attack? Yeah. He's already gonna attack. Yeah, I can start paying off his guys yeah. with burning vengeance. Yep. But you gotta be quick about it. You should auto yield to that thing. Yeah, flashback, think, dream twist, and desperate ravings. <laughs> this deck is so funny. Yeah. This matchup is so funny. Yeah. You just got to be very conscious of time because you, you're going to have to go to game three. Mm -hmm. You only have six minutes left. No. Really. Just block one. Auto yield. Desperate ravings, why not? It's gonna unflip my guy, but it's I guess fine. that doesn't matter. You're winning on your turn. Auto yield, uh, yeah. Your occultist trigger. And then f block one. And then F6. And then I F6. F6, yeah. And then hit OK, don't attack. Alright. Now the challenge is to not time out. <laughs> 